About 200 employees handed over a petition to the management of Namib Mills to demand prompt action against these complaints within 14 days. They say prior attempts to seek recourse against such complaints did not yield any fruitful outcome and now threaten to lodge a dispute with the Ministry of Labor, Industrial Relations and Employment Creation. Acting Secretary General of Solidarity Union, Samuel Muyoro, also claims that employees of color are often subjected to alcohol tests, whereas fellow white employees are not, which is discriminatory. If a person fails to accomplish these 140 times per month, they give a person a final warning. And this final warning is coupled, is coupled to a deduction uh, from your annual bonus. These people are entitled to a bonus, but if you, if you have a final warning, they also reduce your money. Should you continue not uh, completing these 140 times, you're dismissed. They allege that so far 78 employees lost their jobs in the last six months due to such disciplinary hearings. Abel Kahinasho, a Namib Mills employee of four years, says their working conditions are inhumane. Whatever we do, it's under their control. They are even controlling our money and they are even controlling ourselves. Any mistake you did already affect your bonus. And if you further do any mistake, a very simple mistake, you are already out. They are dismissing everybody like the way you do. And they even put a breathalyzer for only black people, not for the boys. A further 33 employees are currently facing disciplinary hearings. Contacted for comment, Namib Mills Public Relations and Communications Officer Ashante Manetti says they will study the complaints and respond within the stipulated time frame. Namib Mills is the largest producer of grain products in Namibia and employs about 1,200 workers countrywide.